Hello, I'm Rancho Palos Verde City Manager Ara Moranian with an update from the May 7th City Council meeting. The RPV City Council continues to address the ongoing state of emergency in the Portuguese Bend Landside Complex area. The Council approved construction contracts for two emergency hydrogers that will be installed in the complex to slow the unprecedented land movement impacted by record rainfall. The Council also extended the emergency declaration implemented last October due to the accelerated movement. For months, the landslide complex, comprised of Portuguese Bend, Abalone Cove, and Klondike Canyon, has wreaked havoc on homes, shut down roads, trails, and utilities, and the historic Wayfarers Chapel. Palos Verdes Drive South has been severely impacted, and the council received an update on plans to regrade the area known as the Ski Jump along Palos Verdes Drive South. As many as 16,000 cars a day travel Palos Verdes Drive South, and the public will receive updates on the regrading schedule and expected traffic impacts. Moving on to other items before the Council, the City Council approved ETCO's request for a 6% increase for residential solid waste and collection services. The increase for fiscal year 24-25 will cost the average consumer less than 60 cents a month due to recycling rebates that offset the new rate. The Council also approved the updated fiscal year 2024-25 master schedule of fees for all City services. The Council agreed to forego the 4% increase from the March 2024 Consumer Price Index and removed outdated fees no longer applicable. Facility rental fees were increased for Ladera Linda Community Park and Athletic Fields, and minor updates were made to planning fee descriptions. Meanwhile, staff updated the Council on state legislation of interest to the City. The council voted to take various positions on bills that will impact everything from public safety to housing and local control. The council supported a bill that would create school walk zones and slow down the speed limit near schools. The council also opposed several bills impacting housing and local land use. For more information on these bills, the landslide, and other issues being addressed by the City Council, watch the May 7th meeting on RPV TV or on the City's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected, and remember, we are RPV together.